Welcome back to Teshkid FX for another Gala Games price prediction update which at the time of this recording is holding below the 20 day MA here on the 1 hour chart which is now acting as resistance for us to continue gearing up. Here on the 1 hour chart we have also been able to print this long week to the lower side which is an indication that the sellers are losing momentum and the buyers are trying to get a little bit stronger. And you can see that after the print of this long week to the lower side, the market has been on an uptrend and we have seen a bit of a run up to the upper side. And the moment we manage to break above the 20 day MA and it acts as support, then there are high chances of seeing a bit of further upside here on the Gala Games chart. We have also continued to obey the ADOTF structures where you can see that after seeing our low on the 23rd of March, we started this massive run up to the upper side obeying the ADOTF structures where you can see I have these five wave structure to the upside completing the formation of that first wave. Then we started a corrective structure in the formation of this wave two in a move that had its minimum target areas highlighted here on the charts using this white target area. And at the time of this recording, you can see that we are still holding within the minimum retracement areas in the formation of this wave two. And there are also high chances that we have now bottomed out in the formation of this wave two. And we are now ready for that massive pump to the upside in the formation of this wave three. And before I get further into the technical analysis to give you my short term scenarios and also give you my breakdown targets here on the Gala Games chart, first give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and also check out the channel membership. And there are two possible scenarios that are playing out here on the Gala Games chart and both scenarios are bullish. And the first one is that we have now bottomed out in this wave two since we have managed to get into the minimum retracement area and almost fully maximize that minimum target area. And if that is the case, we can sketch out a target area in the formation of this wave three using a trend based Fibonacci, connecting it from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one, then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave. And that now gives me a target area in the formation of that wave three at the FIB level 1.618 and that is at around the 0.06924 dollar mark. That is the first possible scenario that you can have in mind here on the Gala Games chart. And the second scenario is that whatever we saw over here was the start of this wave three, but at some point that move to the upside failed. And that's the reason as to why we are seeing a bit of a break. We have been seeing a bit of a breakdown to the lower side back into the minimum retracement area in this wave two. And if that is the case, there are chances that we can term this as an ABC corrective structure, having that as the wave A, then a wave B, and there are high chances of seeing one more leg down within this white target area in the formation of that wave two. And in case such a move plays out, then that will be putting in place a new low in the formation of that wave two before we can start the massive run up to the upside in the formation of that wave three. So those are the two possible scenarios that I have here on the Gala Games chart on the short term scenarios. And to also give you the long term outlook using this ADOTF structure right here in blue, where we picked in the formation of a larger ADOTF count one in a move that gave us a high at around the 0.0628 dollar mark. And after seeing the formation of that first wave, we saw that corrective structure in this wave two in a move that bottomed out within this blue target area. And on the long term scenarios, I'm expecting higher prices in the formation of this wave three. And because of its impulsive nature, I'm also expecting to see micro edit wave counts within the formation of that wave three. And that's the reason as to why you have seen these white edit wave structures which has just given me the short term scenarios where we could be in the formation of that wave two and there are high chances of seeing that massive run up to the upside very soon in the formation of that wave three. And that is what I'm expecting here on the short term scenarios and also on the long term scenarios. And also taking a look at the indicators on the RSI we are trading 
at around the 43 mark meaning we have massive room for us to fully support higher prices also taking a look at the MACD we have been able to print a bullish cross here on the one hour MACD suggesting that higher prices are coming our way so let's be patient and see how that plays out and I'll be keeping you updated.